Yo, what's up guys? It's so hot outside. I'm drawing. Oh, 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 oh. Had to come to my local hardware store because I need some tape. And oh, let me lock my car. <laughs> need to get uh, some tape, so yeah. Bag secured. We got some freaking blue tape and some masking tape because, of course. So what you need to do, you need to make sure you cover your rotor with a bag. And yeah, um, I should cover my car. I don't want to get over spray, but we're going to clean this. Spray cleaner. Um, I have a grease remover or whatever, that's spray cleaner. And we're going to just wipe everything down and get this covered up. And we're going to tape this up right here. So. That way we don't get that. We're gonna, we're gonna really change that. And yeah, but I'm gonna just clean the brakes now. I'm not gonna bore you with that. I'm gonna clean the front and the back. And then we're gonna put this on and we're gonna get started. Also, I do have some tape as well to cover up some other stuff. So yeah, let's get to it. And another really helpful tip. So whenever you clean this stuff, make sure you have a mask because you don't want any of that stuff getting in your, breathing it into your lungs. And also you wear sunglasses because you don't want anything getting into your eyes as well because we're gonna be using this, we're gonna be using this. Some steel wool to clean it. So you really don't want any of these particles in your system. So yeah, just a little tip. Even though it's my first time, but <laughs> there you go. Let's get it. Guys, 
are good and also a good thing to do always do the back front front back whatever just oh shoot make sure you're always um paying attention damn remember always let this dry about 10 minutes so as we wait I'm gonna go eat some food so yeah also I got a cover back there too I'm kind of drawing but actually it's just the rope piping whatever but yeah So, ooh. So here we go. First layer done. Guys, it looks so cool, so nice. Like, <sighs> man. It's been maybe about maybe two hours and I only done one side. So another two hours, can't wait to show you guys, but man, changes the whole look of the car. <laughs> and it's a big brake kiss, so you can see that it's huge. But man, let's get to the other side. You paying them gold? Yeah, bro. You like them though? Yeah, it, it looks really good. It actually kind of fits with the car, right? It fits really nicely. Hey, what's up? Hey. How are you? Good, how are you? So, were you, were you running it? Okay, guys, so it kind of got a little dark out because I've been taking my time with it. But, as you can see, let me move this light. Here. As you can see, we finished. And yeah, I painted the infinity sign as well. And I painted the forged because they're forged wheels. So I thought that looked pretty cool. So yeah. This is it, and I'll show you guys, well, for me tomorrow, but you guys right after this clip. But I'll show you it. Do a walk around. And yeah, I need to get lowered. But yeah, this will look so good. Quality is definitely bad, but all I gotta say is this spoon came in clutch because you already know <laughs> you already know how to get creative with it <laughs> we painted the fours and the infinity sign to complete the look but you'll get a better look in the daytime so but yeah it looks so this is really nice that just the gold accents man super excited i'm recording this on my phone because i don't have the better lens for nighttime recording and this has got to go this is gonna go i'm gonna make that black so but yeah for all the people we got our car back so here's a cold start <laughs> 